Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this XSplit broadcaster video, I'm going to be showing you how you can change the resolution of your video output. Uh, this is of course going to be very important because as you can see up here in the top right hand corner it defaults to 640 pixels by 360 pixels at 30 frames per second resolution. Now 30 FPS is perfectly fine and standard for sites like YouTube but uh, a resolution that small is not. It's really not good enough for these days uh, because mo usually if you're streaming online you're either streaming or broadcasting in 720p or 1080p resolution which means 1280 pixels by 720 or 1920 pixels by 1080. Therefore this is way too small people will complain about having a resolution like this and you won't get the views that you need. So in order to change that it's actually quite simple. You don't find it in the settings menu. You just go over here and you click on this drop down menu that you can see indicated by the arrow and you can find resolution um, as the first section in that drop down. Now what you're probably going to want to be broadcasting in as I mentioned 720p or 1080p um, if your system can sustain it good if not maybe 480p. I, I think that's the absolute minimum that most people would want to watch. You can also add in custom resolutions over here, but generally speaking, those are the two that you're going to need right there. Now, if you happen to have a really powerful computer, you can consider um, basically doing things in 60 FPS. Now, with my basic understanding, I, I believe that's about going to double your video file size because there's twice as many frames that it's capturing. And because it's capturing at twice the rate, you're going to need a more powerful machine. But uh, some people really do like 60 FPS. It is possible to upload videos to YouTube like that. Um, 30 FPS is the standard, but 60 if you have a supercomputer, and then you probably want to do 60 at 1920 by 1080. But uh, the whole idea here, to change the resolution, you simply need to come into this drop-down menu find the resolution you want, go ahead and click it, and it's automatically going to resize things. You may have to uh, modify your elements in the uh, the scene down here, basically customizing your webcam size, customizing uh, the images or the overlays you may have, and the game itself. But aside from that, that's really all there is to changing your resolution in XSplit Broadcaster. So I've been Chris, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.